If this was to fall down, if this was to, if this was to fall down, I cry. Let me be thumb you. There's something. That man, them feel like jump on these games. Obviously, I'm be a different type of man. Nah. That's not a normal thing. Man. That's this thing, man. Damn it. I gotta get my hands on that. Hey guys, welcome back to another ICKV gaming video and we're going to be doing things a little bit different today. Now as you can see in the title, we're going to be talking about the new generation of consoles. Yes, the Xbox Series S and why I paid $620 after 8 months of it being released. Let's get into the video, Madman thing. The Xbox Series S and X was released worldwide November the 10th, 2020. Now in this video, we're going to be unboxing this little bad boy and seeing how, many perf how much performance we get on the new generation of consoles and why is it so hard for you to get one of these eight months later. Now the reason why I paid $620 for this Xbox is because I do not live in the US, I do not live in the UK. I live in a small Caribbean country named Trinidad and Tobago. It's a twin island country and we don't have Best Buy or Target or even Walmart in Trinidad. And I ordered this with a company that orders or brings down uh, bring down stuff for people who cannot order it themselves because we don't usually use MasterCards and Visa cards. So on Target and on Walmart they have it at different prices. Um how much how much is for a uh, 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 the Xbox Series S at Target in these places. Target has it for two ninety nine, and Walmart has it for three eighty two. Okay, and how much? How much does Best Buy have it for? Best Buy has it for two ninety nine. See, so the reason this is for two ninety nine, and this is is out of stock right now. So you're not even getting it at that price that when they have it on sale or when they when they do have it. And now when Xbox has stocks and they release this, you cannot get it because scalpers and boss, they purchase and buy it and then you sell it, they sell it for double the price, which I paid. Now, now enough about me spending $620 on a $299 console. Let's get into the unboxing. Now, man's, man's, man's can't wait to unbox this thing, yeah? You know, I've got my handy, my handy box cutter, you don't know, right? I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see if I can like unbox this without using a box cutter yeah because i know it rips out the tape so we're going oh my thing is mad oh my days oh my days oh that's one down you know what i'm saying i have to take my time with this because you know man man yeah yeah you don't know all right we're gonna do the next side so talking about the xbox series x so i came from the new i came from the old original xbox console the xbox vcr okay so this is a huge upgrade for me now i i was trying to get the new xbox series x but it was out of stock and i would i would probably have to pay almost a thousand to twelve hundred dollars for the new xbox series s series x so i'm not going to be doing that so i purchased this and i'm a i'm a gamer that i don't usually game with cds so this is an old digital xbox it's not you can't put cds in this you can't do none of that all right we have one more at the bottom here again all right let's take this last one out hopefully i don't have to cut it because i don't want the box to get smudged all right ah yo this sounds so sexy man oh my days Oh man, it's getting pieces of the box, man. Oh my god. Don't worry, that's the Spanish part, so I don't have to worry. Alright, so we got all of this out, man. Throw this in the corner over there. Now we're gonna be doing the real unboxing now. Alright, so yeah. So I don't know if you guys can see, but you'll be you'll be seeing from the other camera on this side, on the handheld. Let's see how it looks. Oh my god. We have Xbox. Yo, this thing is small, fam. Look, we have the I like the attention to detail on this, the Xbox in the inside of it yeah oh my days bruv it says now nah, yeah now nah, this has some weight to it yeah it has some weight to it man power your dreams man oh my goodness man yo this thing feels yo what do you think about it man yo it looks really cool man i like it it's small fam it's really really freaking small man it's, it's really small all right let's oh my god yo man I'm, I'm a person that likes to keep the box yo this thing feels like i'm a strong guy i'm a big guy and it's it's weird it's weird that, that that small thing has has the weight on that man, right? So now we have, I don't know if you can see in this, we have the setup guide for like the controller, which is the get started. I don't know if you guys can see that, right? And then they have, they, they did a lot of packaging this time. Like the new Xbox Series S, like the one that I had, the Xbox, the original Xbox version, the box was not this small, but the packaging was my days. All right, so let's, let's, oh, my plants in there, man, the plants. Let me, let's close this and let's, 
see the, the, the Xbox itself. So opening the oh my days. Opening the Xbox, it's really, it's really yo, the thing is the, the thing is packaged really nice. Oh my days. Yo, I'm scared, man. I'm really scared, man. I don't want nothing to happen to this man. So I'm I'm assuming it says on the box that you can play up to 120 FPS, right? If you have a 120 hertz TV. Now I do not have that. I have a 60 hertz TV, 4K TV. Now the Xbox Series S, oh my god, the Xbox Series S can play up to 120 4K, but that's upscale uh, 4K, not not native 4K. Mad. Yo, okay, so as you can see, it has two, it has two USB, two USB ports in the back, HDMI out, the storage uh, uh, for you to buy the little storage thing, and then well, you have Ethernet and well, your power cable, and in the front we have another USB A or USB C, I don't even know. Yeah, port in the front. Now this is a, it's a physical button this time. It's not your normal average button. It's your physical button this time. Oh man. All right, let's put this to the side. Let's put it to the side and let's 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 check out what the what it came in the box. Put this aside here. Let's check out what came. What came in the box all right so as we have here we have okay so we have two hdmi high speed cables right high speed cables um now this is now if you does you don't have one of these you need to probably get like an xbox version of this or like try to get almost the same exact type of hdmi because if you're using anything less of them cheap hdmis it's not gonna it's not gonna work it's, it, will, it will work but you're not gonna get the same uh uh quality of 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 things on it yeah right so all right let's this is the power cable right the power cable um oh nice all right uh let me don't put it to the side i'm gonna put it right here okay so that's all over here and now we're gonna be talking we're gonna be seeing all right we're gonna be we're gonna be seeing the the controller the xbox series s controller let me put this on this side let me put it on this side so you can you guys can see so this is the new xbox series s controller so now as you already knew before the xbox one controller was a very good controller maybe one of the best controllers of all time and as xbox said if it's, it's if it's not broken you don't need to fix it the only thing with this controller it has the share button and it has like grips like grip my oh my days Yo, the thing has grip. The thing has freaking grip on the triggers, man. Yo, look how sleek this shit's naive things look, man. Oh my days, yo. No, no, no. This thing looking, nah, different, different. All right. And now Xbox controllers don't. I don't think any Xbox controller came with like rechargeable batteries. So it came with you know double A batteries, normal double A batteries. Um. All right, normal double A. But I think they want to keep Duracell. Is it Duracell? Yeah, they want to keep Duracell in, in business, man. You know. Now to to compare these controllers, I have an Xbox original Xbox controller. Next, this is how it looks. It's it's almost the same, but it's really different. Now I think the Xbox, the original Xbox controller, is a bit. I think probably a bit bigger. But yeah, it's probably a bit bigger than the than the Series S. So as you can see on this one, it doesn't have the the, the share button, and on this one. On the S, it has the controller, right? Um, oh my God, this feels so good. Now, the there's two different things on it, yeah? So this one has the normal D-pad, up, down, left, right. And this one has the, the tactical D-pad. So you can, you know, almost to like the elite version, right? So, so this, no, I, 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 I am glad that I've gotten the new Xbox Series S. I mean, it was one of the best. I've heard that it's one of the best next-gen consoles because the PS5, they have the old digital edition, but it's not, it's, it's not like spec down as this one. So this is a budget one. And I'm telling you, this has some weight to it. It's not light. It's not light. You can feel it. You're not going to purchase a $300 PC, right? A $300 PC and get what this does. You know what I'm saying? Now, on the box, before we, before we jump into the gameplay, before we jump I know you guys are waiting for the gameplay man before we jump into the gameplay the Xbox velocity architecture man that and the and your um and the space on this I think you can only get like now it comes with 512 uh gigabyte of SSD but you don't get that like the operating system takes up about 200 or 100 and something SS, um gigabytes and then you have probably around 320 gigabytes free after you're installed and upgraded so let's go and jump in to the setup part of this video all right, let's jump into the setup video of the Xbox Series S. Bear in mind, if you're hearing noise in the background, that's my fan. Yeah, it's making warm in my freaking room. So first, do you start off with confirmation of like your location? So I've put in the United Kingdom because that's the place that I flex with. Um, they ask me for my location. I put where is UK? Um, all right, the United Kingdom. Yeah, I'm putting the UK. All right, next. All right, so this need. Okay, cool. This is an update then. It's an update. Okay, so it's updating on my computer. 
it on my TV right now. Okay, instant on. Um, keep my data from last time, because yeah, I want, I want that. Uh, when you remove the feature, I don't know if communication with the console. Uh, turn on this, yeah. All right, let's get me signed in now. Now, everything is happening on my console right now. Okay, so I had a password. Okay, access for my passkey. Ask for my passkey. Um, add found, nah. Who's Terrence Ocean? I don't, I don't know who that is. Skip. Uh, yeah. Also, this is Go Go Ultimate. Yeah, I have this, so no tanks. Uh, no next. Okay, so here's the the cool part. So you can name your console. So let me name my Xbox. Um, I C K B Xbox. All right. Next. Um, sending me offers. Uh, sure. Cause I, I can remember it's a it's an online computer. It's an online uh series s so you're not you're not able to use that um let's see what okay so these were the past these were the past uh, apps that i had on my old xbox so i'm uh, not netflix youtube what else soundcloud yep um tmx yep i think that's that's basically it i don't have anything else i would get crunchyroll but my subscription for that is over so i don't need that what else okay so this was the time that i backed up my xbox the, the previous xbox that i had this was the series um the xbox original vcr so i'm gonna pick from the last 18 days so that's when i sold my xbox the last 18 days is when i wiped my xbox and i sold it so yeah copy that nope this will not be used by kids man no and here and here's the dashboard and here's the dashboard and right now my xbox is being um updated right now and let's let's jump into some gameplay right now let's jump into some gameplay This might be a good place to land, but what do I know? I can. This is a good LZ. Here, pals. Plotting a landing's one of my specialities. This time down here. Hold on tight. It's time to drop shot and rock. Gee, it's the only way to travel.
Choose your tack map and choose when to deploy from the aircraft. The white circle on your tack map shows where the gas closes in. The timer shows how long you have before that happens. Plan ahead, find the weapon, stay out of the open, and you'll make it. Jump out of the aircraft, soldier. I suggest pulling your chute before you hit the ground. Using your chute lets you glide away from everyone else. But you'll get on the ground late. Well guys, as you can see, the Xbox Series S performs superbly. I don't know about the, the quality that YouTube has it up when I'm, when I'm showing the gameplay, but the gameplay is crisp, man. 
things looking nice and sweet man so at ending off of the video this is a ps4 controller and this is the xbox series s controller now this is the dualshock i think four or three i don't even know because mine's not a playstation guy and this is the xbox series s controller now that you can see the xbox is a little bit you know nicer you know what i'm saying it has more textile grip in the end and people might some people might not like how the xbox series s looks because it has like a big looking speaker thing in the front here but the fan cools this down it runs really silent when i when i put it on it runs it runs really silent i didn't hear anything no noise and i was playing game for hours man man was playing games for days well not really days but you know i had it on i tested it out for like a, a few hours and it worked perfectly fine you're not gonna get a 300 pc for this what this can do so what i suggest you go out and buy an xbox series s if you're not getting the xbox one the xbox series x and the, and the playstation 5 right now i think this is the best thing that you can get for your buck if it is that you want to start playing next generation console next generation games on your newer consoles now this is going to be going for five six years for of a lifespan or whatever it is but i'm telling you guys if it is that you're not getting any of those consoles man pick yourself up an xbox series s because it has um it comes with well it doesn't come with game pass you have to pay for game pass and you get over a hundred games i'm talking about blockbuster game i'm talking about big things you know man. i'm not talking about them little indie games we're talking about we're talking about cyberpunk we're talking about all these games man that you're gonna get for the series s it's, it's a digital console if it is that you don't if it is that you like your cds and you like having like your disc and you want to sell it you cannot do it with this because this don't have a, a, a cd drive it was a nice i'm glad to be playing this but if it is i do get the chance to get myself i'm gonna do an unboxing if it is you're new to the channel please leave a like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell right down below we're gonna be doing a bit more a bit more reviews on this channel so stay tuned for some new accessories for the xbox series s and the controller and if it is you want if it is i get my hands on the xbox series x i'm gonna do a review a review on that man so la man subscribe you're done no man's gonna be turning a techie you know what i'm saying like that i'll see you in the next video fam boom